Hey, man, I've used that intro so many times now. So today we're gonna to be building ourselves a desk PC. Not just any desk PC though, one that's in the shape of an L desk, nice and long with lots of space. One that has built-in speakers and the entire desk only cost me about a hundred dollars. Minus the computer parts that I already had those, so. So step one was cutting out all the pieces. I started by creating the case for the computer using some of the plywood that was left over and turning into a giant box shape. I also placed the glass in the spot I wanted it to be and cut it out, however I also did this off camera as well, but I'm pretty sure you could figure it out, you just put it down, draw a line and cut it out with a jigsaw. Once I finished putting the case part that was going to hold all the computer components together, I then went on to start cutting out all the holes where I wanted the computer parts to go, such as the fan holes and other slots for wires. I used a broken motherboard I had as a template, as well as a broken power supply and hard drives. If you don't have these, I suppose you could just do measurements or maybe, I don't know, create a template out of cardboard or something like that. That's up to you. Once I finished with the holes, I painted it black as I wanted it to stand out a little bit from the other parts of the desk that were going to be stained brown. Once it was dry, I attached it to the L desk using glue and wood brackets along the sides, which actually holds up really well. Once all put together and dry, I drilled two holes out where I was going to put the speakers and then stained it brown to give it a little pop. Finally, once this all was dry, which took about 24 hours, I'd say, I got my brother to help me take it inside because holy crap, it was a lot heavier than I thought it would be. Sitting on the cord to lift it a bit. <sighs> but we managed, only dropping it once or twice along the way. All right, so before I install it, I'm gonna show you guys the power button and how I wired it up. So I got this on eBay for about like two, three dollars, something like that. When you press it, it turns on and it's got a little blue light that'll go around it and it looks really cool. So to wire it up, what I actually did is I took one, two of these little power switches that you can just get on Amazon for probably like a couple bucks. I had a bunch of them laying around. So what I did is I just cut this off here, stripped the wires and then then I attached them on the left and right side and that creates the power switch. And then I took the resistor that it came with. You probably don't need one, but it came with it. So I figured I'd put it on, put it on the top and the bottom with another set of wires. And that's, then I connect that to the power LED slot. And that basically turns on the LED. And I don't know, it's pretty simple. If you want me to go more in depth, let me know. I can do a video, but I don't know. It's a switch. It, it's nothing too fancy. Um, if you do want, you could use things like these. They're just single versions of the, of the wires you can get online, they're really cheap as well. Or you can just use normal wires, wire to wire and solder, solder them on, but that's really dangerous, so I wouldn't recommend that. Anyway, that's what I did. And now finally that we're done that, all that's left is to put all the electronics into it. So I'm gonna put a little montage here of me putting it together, and I uh, guess enjoy. Okay, now before we actually get to the whole glam thing, I'm just gonna say, 
that's it for me. So if you did enjoy the video, please make sure to leave a like down below. If you have any comments on what I could improve on or what I did wrong, because I'm sure some of the PC people out there have an opinion to say, there's a comment section for that. And if you want to see other videos like this or things that I might do in the future, because I've always got other expensive ideas, you can hit that subscribe button. And that's about it. Enjoy.